fire grows pretty quick. So when you need water, you need water. Daryl Sanders has been working on contract for BC Wildfire with his water tender for four years. This year, though, he's having trouble parking the vehicle in Penticton. Well, we've got uh, a water tender that we park generally in front of our house during fire season. Um, the city is taking it upon themselves that it's very intrusive to have the truck parked on the street. He's already gotten one ticket. A neighbor has offered to house the vehicle in their driveway for now. I mentioned to them, I said, hey, you know, we're, we're trying to fight fire here in the, in the summertime and uh, we try to keep the truck close by. You know, it's, it, it isn't mandatory that the truck's parked uh, on, the, on the street, but I would think if it's an emergency situation, it'd be kind of nice if it was close by to, uh, to get there quicker. Penticton Bylaw Services Supervisor Tina Siebert said a vehicle more than 5,600 kilograms can't park in a residential area, and that complaints from the public were the reason why the city ticketed in the first place. I just hope that uh, this gets out and People might think uh, about when they're voting in the next uh, election about uh, maybe having some people that'll take care of some of these issues that we've been dealing with in town, and I'm sure they will this year. Chelsea Powery, Castanet News, Penticton.